Yo, my hips right here. That shit is staying in. Don't look at my cankles. Don't look at my toes. Mm -hmm. You see what? You see that shit? You see it? Uh, okay, let's do this, bitch. <laughs> I have abs now. Ooh. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> Oh yeah, she don't look crazy, bro. Hey, besties. Do not mind the hair. Mind your own. <laughs> Today, I'm really trying to be on the health grind. But also, I'm realistically just fucking busy. Like, I am just busy. So I can't be like, perfect yogurt bowl here. Go to the gym. Walk to the gym. Like, I can't do all that. Because again, like, I'm just busy. Like, I got shit to do on my to-do list. I just want a realistic... But it real, like realistically doing my health grind shit. I don't know if that makes sense. I have been struggling with like overeating recently and <laughs> it's really been taking a toll on me, girl. I don't know, it's like when you're in the moment, you're like, oh, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. But then after you're like, what the fuck did I just do? Because I'm over here like spending my last time on all these door dashes. I'm literally just like stuffing my face just to stuff my face. I haven't done any movement. So I've changed that in the last like day or so. I deleted door dash. Mm -hmm. I did like a 30 minute workout, 30 minute indoor walk because I have a walking pad at home. So it's like, okay, I'm really just trying to change things. And now I'm trying to cook because... I haven't cooked in a minute and also I haven't really had breakfast in a long time which is also the reason I think I've been like overeating more because I've just like suppressed my my appetite I guess or like my need to eat and then I like cave at the evening time and start eating like everybody <laughs> they're just trying to incorporate better habits but in a realistic day bitch because I got shit to do so having all these problems it's not worth my time right now like i gotta conquer that shit and move on so we're gonna do it together i old some tortillas mm -hmm. super yummy we have our egg mixture yeah we have some cut up sausages and i don't have any cheese which, sh which should be a good thing because i am lactose intolerant but <laughs> it's not it's not complete without the cheese <laughs> but i guess <laughs> <laughs> I also don't have much in the fridge today Like literally she is sports But you know Do what you can Today I really want to do an at home workout Yesterday I worked out at home And brr, the full body was hitting I woke up so sore Like as if I actually did work out at the gym so we're gonna work out together, do a little full body situation. Yo, my hips right here. That shit is staying in. I'm literally just not trying to be too hard on myself and just be fucking realistic. Because that's all I can do. Like, I just can't keep dwelling on shit and be like, mm, I could have done better here. Or if I stayed consistent for the past month, then I could have gotten this progress. Like, shut the fuck up. Like, that's not gonna happen. That's in the past already. Yesterday was the past. Today is now. Tomorrow is the future. It's like, control what you can control because, yeah. I think that too, sometimes I'm like, damn, like, if I stay consistent, then from January to now, I would already had the body I wanted. But what the fuck is that gonna do? Just make us depressed as fuck. So don't think like that. Don't think like that. Just learn from that experience accept it and try to do the steps today to get better at it you know because the reason why you didn't stick with it was because something was unrealistic for you her routine isn't gonna work for you sometimes my routine might not work for you sometimes but these are the other people's routines you can see and try to implement into your own life you yeah. just because this girl did it to lose 20 pounds this doesn't mean that it might work for you because again, this might be their full-time job. You know, this might be the only thing they do. You know, because they are a fitness creator. Okay, you don't know. You don't know. Someone's genetics. You don't know. Somebody might be okay with genuinely calorie tracking and eating like a rabbit and, and, and just eating chicken and rice every day. 
but I'm not like that. Like I can't do that, you know. But who says you can't do? It? So it's like different. Like for me, I tried that lifestyle and it didn't work for me because I just don't like the um, the feeling of restriction. I think that mentally I'm not there for that, you know. Like people are like it's a mindset, it's a shift. But I'm like, girl, I want to eat what I want to eat. I just gotta work on moderation. I just gotta work on realizing that food is not the enemy. Like your mind is, you know. And so for some people, people might think that I'm weak. But for other people, people might be like, oh shit, yeah, like that's like me, like that's twin energy, like, let's figure this out, let's work on this. So again, it's all about perspective, it's all about who you are. And try your best not to compare yourself and just see how you are in your life and what can realistically work for you. Right, don't be too hard on yourself, Neil. Shut your mouth, I'm gonna punch you. Here is the brekkie. I added some Tabasco on it because we literally don't have any salsa. We don't have no fucking vegetables, nothing. <laughs> so, yeah. Let's do a first bite together. Ooh, uh, ah, yummy. Cheers. Mmm. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I wish I had some, like, avocado. Or like onions. Oh my god, that'd be so good. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Hello, Leave me down below, what are you eating for breakfast? Okay, what is your favorite breakfast foods? Okay, because I need some new breakfast options. Girl, she is running out of ideas. So let me know, besties. It is currently 12.31, and I'm having my little snacky snack, my little Lunchable. This was supposed to be like my after workout snack, but um, we're eating it now. I don't know, bitch. I'm just feeling so tired, so lazy. I also have to remind myself that I really did clean my room. This was the before of my room. By the way, this is how it used to look like, like two days ago, and this is how it looks now. So, you know, uh, I mean, I'm still gonna work out. Like, I have that in my mind, like, set in my mind, like, I'm gonna work out. But I think I'm just gonna enjoy my little snacky snack. Got turkey, American cheese, and the Ritz. Instead of feeling super down in the dumps about it and being like, oh, I'm gonna just give up working out today. Cause that happens, you know, when you're just like, all right, set on a time and where you're gonna work out and it doesn't work out. And you're like, fuck it, like, I'm just not gonna do it and I'll start on Monday. You know what I mean? So I'm not gonna do that. I'm just gonna let myself just chill because that's like what my body is craving right now. And in a couple hours, I'll check back in and we're gonna get this workout in, girl. Yeah, we're gonna like slowly take our time <laughs> to do the healthy habits because I feel like Sometimes I push myself to the extreme where I'm just like fuck it. I'm already not feeling the mood and I'm not gonna do it But it's like no girl mm -mm, That's not how that shit works You have to stay consistent in whatever you want to do you want to be a better person, you got to stay consistent with treating others better. You got to be consistent with treating yourself better. You want to be a workout girly, you got to be consistent even on the hard days. You know, so it's like just shifting your mindset with this, shifting your schedule, your routine. Like, I am pretty busy today, but I've done a lot of like editing, cleaning, and like managing things the past couple of days that today I can afford to to get a little bit easier like i don't have to give my 90 percent today i can just give like a good like 40 percent 50 percent and still get all my tasks done and you know achieve what i want to achieve because my the main goal is to stay consistent stay consistent with posting on youtube stay consistent with my social media and posting every single day staying consistent with working out but just again doing it at a 40 percent level and 7 90 percent level because hey that's just the vibe that i'm going off of today This is so good. Oh my god. Don't be too hard on yourself, okay? Some days you can give the 90% and some days all you have is your 40% energy. And that's just that's just what it is. That's just what it is. Mm -hmm. It is 4.16 p.m. I was literally contemplating 
do I want to do this? <laughs> but listen, I let myself relax for a bit, enjoy my time, enjoy my leisure time, and I am red safe. I feel like if I didn't get up right near, I would have regretted at the end of the night because I would have been like, I'm just a fucking loser. I'm a slob. But because I got my ass up, I'm gonna feel accomplished. So I mixed some pre in here. I only did half a scoop because yesterday I did a full scoop and I, <laughs> I almost tweaked the fuck out. Yes, I did. I need to look cute. This is the only way I will get motivation to work out and feel good and like kill the workout because right now that's the only motivation oh, I got yeah, going. Tanya. Huh? Tanya. Oh. So I'm gonna try to do like the little crisscross sports bra moment. <laughs> so if I don't eat this, I'm going to bed. <laughs> Sometimes all you need is a really fucking good outfit because I think I do want to work out. <laughs> I think maybe I do want to work out today. <laughs> you can't fucking tell me shit right now, girl. Oh my god. Like, who the fuck you think you are? You think you're the shit, bitch? You're not a fart. You can't tell me nothing, girl. Oh. <laughs> Sometimes, even if you don't go to the gym, put on that cute fit, go in your room or your restroom, and do your little workout, okay? Worky work is better than nothing. Okay, so... Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm gonna start, girl, hold on. Not my bayang being chopped off. I'm gonna start with my walking pad. Okay, let me show you. Come here, come here, bestie. So this is the walking pad I got her off of TikTok shop. I feel like you can find better ones on Amazon. This one, it is like, look at this shit. I don't know if I did it wrong. I don't know what, bitch, but yeah. There's like way better ones on Amazon that, I mean, it is more expensive, but it's more stable with the handle. And then, of course, the one without the handle is like the cheapest one. So, I recommend Amazon, okay? But I just got it off a of TikTok shop because they were having a deal. And so, me and my mom went have these on this. But I think this was around like 180 but again, this shit went up now. The market, bleh, bleh. so just I recommend Amazon, okay, girly. Anyways, I'm gonna do a 30 minute little walkie what? Really trying to up my stamina, and I'm really trying to up my endurance because I have really bad knees, and so I just really wanna, you know, build that endurance and that strength for my knee. I have my show going on right there on the TV. I have my walking pad, I got my phone because I got the Hulu and I got the commercial version. Well, I'm not paying, so I should be grateful. My girlfriend is love you, Buki. And so I got my TikTok going, and we're gonna kill this 30 minute. Let's go. <laughs> Bitch, hold on. She is kind of eating the. Uh, uh. Hey, hey, hey. Oh, look. <laughs> Let me stop fucking around, girl. Hold on. I literally just finished my walk, 30 minute walk. What the hell? I am tired, girl. I want to give up so many times, but I was like, come on, we're almost there. Come on, we're almost there. I don't even know if I want to work out. Like, I'm feeling so, like yesterday I was like, okay, 30 minute walk, yeah, I'm down to work out, yeah. But today I'm feeling so low energy, but I still want to do a little bit, like muy poquito, because I'm already in a cute outfit, like why waste it? And like my arms, like I need it. Why waste it? Why waste it? But let me show you my ring for proof, bitch. I'm sweating. Boom, here is my ring. Okay, did the 30 minutes almost hit a mile, but super slay. I need to take a breather because I feel a little dizzy. <laughs> my armpits are moist. Okay, girl, let me just air this bitches out. Oh, hold on. Mm -hmm. You see what? You see that shit? You see? She is doing the damn thing. Oh, I can't wait to build back my quads. They used to have lines. And now it's just kind of. <laughs> you know what? I'm going to work out a little bit. Because you see this like, wait a minute. Wait a minute. I think I left my conscience on the front doorstep. I don't know. I don't think that's the lyrics. But shut your mouth. Mm-hmm. Loki body is giving two seconds later for some reason i'm really not in the mood to continue working out which kind of sucks because i want to be in the vibe like i really want to work out you know i really want to stay consistent i was journaling yesterday and i realized my big goal for the end of the year is to finish off with being consistent like the days that i don't really want to work out and i'm kind of like over it like right now <laughs> I don't try to lift any weights just because if you lose focus, you can really hurt yourself. 
like even if it's like a 10 pound 15 pound dumbbell like if you're just like just doing it just to do it like you know like how my wrist is right now boom you hurt your fucking wrist or you tweak something like that you like it's just not a good idea I'm just gonna do some body movement workouts and i'm really trying to stay consistent with doing my core workouts so i just do three different like stomach workouts i do sit-ups then i do um shit i don't know the names of nothing oh my gosh i do the one where like you know you're sort of you're laying down and you go like this and you like Mm -mm. I do that one then I do it where my le my legs are up and then you know you're doing the sit up so those are the three ones that I'm gonna do and then I might do a little bit of like bicep and hammer curls but not with the dumbbell with the resistance band and yeah I'll see how I feel after that let's do it Usually I don't watch TV while I'm working out like that's a sort of a rule that I'm like, okay No, like we had to listen to music you have to like focus and vibe But literally I have no focus right now like I just want to go to bed like you thought So I'm gonna have my show playing and we're just gonna get the sheet then Because again bitch trying is better than nothing <laughs> And I feel like I have to engrave that in my mind because it's something I'm really trying to understand that like not everything's perfect. Not every day is going to be a great, amazing day. Some days you have your 40% days, girl. And that's today. And that's okay. And I'm so proud of myself because I'm still trying on the days that I really don't want to. Because if it's a good day, you know how easy it is to accomplish your goals. But how many days out of the fucking year is every day going to be a damn good day? No. So you have some days where you just are more like relaxed vibes, very just chill because you worked hard for a couple of days and then today you're just kind of let yourself have a breather, okay girl, because you don't want to burn out. And I suffer from burnout a lot and it's really bad. So I have to acknowledge this feeling. If not, I'm going to burn out and I'm going to like, uh, it's going to have a mental breakdown. It's going to be really bad. So yapping, yeah, yapping, yeah, yapping, yeah, yapping. Yeah, I'm just procrastinating. Uh, uh. Okay, let's do this. <laughs> Trying to hype myself up, bitch. <laughs> Why the fuck is there an onion on my carpet? Are you. Launch. Uh. Okay, let's do this, bitch. Hurry up. I don't wanna do it, but I should. <laughs> I'm working late, cause I'm missing groups. Okay, okay, where'd they go? Wait. Don't look at my cankles. Don't look at my toes. Oh my god. Shut your mouth. Let's go. <laughs> oh god. Oh bad. Okay, we're doing it. We're doing it. We're doing it. Oh. <laughs> we still have 10 more. God damn it. <sighs> oh my goodness. Come on, come on. Let's turn the radio on these. Oh wait, I forgot to turn on my ring. No. What the hell, bro? That's the whole part of this. Now it's going. Oh my god, that whole shit was a waste. Like, none of this shit counted. Uh -huh. Ooh. Uh, do I have abs now? Ooh. Uh. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> now I feel like I have some energy to do some arms, like I said. Let me show you what I'm using. BRB. I'm just using a regular resistance band, like you would buy it on Amazon, search up resistance bands. I had these over four years, so these are really good. So I'm just going to use this to do some bicep curls. I just put one, I just, this is what I do, okay? You just put it on the floor, you step on it, and then you just roll it up, okay? And there you go. Whichever arm you're doing, that's what your feet you're stepping on, okay? When you do bicep curls, I feel like you get the most out of it when you're doing the wide one like this. I feel like you get the most pump. You can do these ones, like don't get it twisted. But I just enjoy these ones more. I feel like it's a better pump and like you feel it more faster. And then for hammer curls, again, the same thing. You just, but then you put your hands facing like this and you just go boom. But make sure to extend all the way down and it go all the way up. Ooh, I already felt a bad after the coming hurt. Oh, I feel a coming. Oh, my shoulder got. <laughs> Bye. It's Officer Jan. That's uh. That's not true. Uh, all I'm asking is that you get Officer uh, Weston. Guys, hold on. Do you see my shoulder? Oh, you see my traps right there? Hold on. A bitch is. Eh. Eh. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Hold, let's get closer. Hold on guys. Oh my gosh, do you guys see that? Oh, you see that line? Shoo! 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 Ah. 
Yeah, hey, hey. Even on the days you don't wanna work out, when you try your best, bitch. Cause I just did, I literally just did sit ups and now just a little pump, little, little, just a little bicep pump and, tr and hammer curl pump. And look, I already feel so good about myself. Like I feel so proud of myself because I don't wanna do it, but I'm doing it. And look, like you only get, you only get happier. Like I'm gonna be so real with you. Like you don't regret this workout. Like even if it was a bad workout and you're like, mm mm. You still feel proud that you actually tried and you did it. So like, take that as a W. <laughs> ah, somebody wanna match my freak? <laughs> no, just kidding. I am cuffed up. I am a wifey to someone. <laughs> I was kind of being lazy to keep like, okay, doing one arm and then switching to this arm and then switching to this arm. So I decided to just like put my feet down in the middle of it, like, and just like do it both at the same time. Yeah, yeah. Tell me that shit don't look crazy, bro. When I look at the mirror, bro, the pump is there. Hopefully it catches on the camera too. Because if my camera is playing with me, you're a fucking hater. Uh, oh my god, I just need to stay consistent. Like, that's literally the only shit I gotta do. Sometimes, sometimes, her, just us girlies, like, you know the girlies who don't have, like, a specific plan or a specific this or a specific routine. Us girlies, I swear to God, if we just stay consistent, no matter what we're doing, shit's gonna happen for us, okay? It might not happen as fast as the girlies who have a plan, who have a workout plan, who have a workout split, who have a meal plan, who have a trainer. But we're not trying to be those girlies because that don't fit with our lifestyles. We don't want that. We don't want to be counting calories and tracking calories and not drinking here and can't go to parties here and has to wake up every day at 6 a.m. here, like... Nah, so honestly, just think consistent, okay? It's gonna work for us. I believe it is. Let's stay locked in, not for your summer, for our life. Okay, girl, but tell me, do I look fit or what? Hopefully, my booby is not popping. I can't see shit. I am a little bit blind, <laughs> so I really can't see far away. But good vibes good vibes good vibes besties i love you guys so much i hope this video motivated you and inspired you that you can be the girl you can be the baddest girl ever but you have to remember stay with your schedule stay with your routine you know who you are you know what I'm trying to say? I'm not saying that you can't switch up your routine and you can't, you know, try all these new new habits and change who you are. Like, don't get it twisted. But you know the systems that you set in place that can actually help you move to the next step to your goals and your dreams. Okay, I'm trying to say, for instance, a lot of people wake up like at 5 a.m. and 6 a.m. to, you know, be ahead of the curve and to be able to do this and that and that and they succeed like that. I tried that and I failed because I cannot do that. That's just not sustainable to me. <laughs> you know what I'm trying to say? It's just not realistic to me. I'm not saying that you can't change your whole life and your whole routine and you can do that, but realistically, being in a relationship, you know, supporting my family, you know, working, you know, content creating, it's just not realistic for me to wake up at 6 a.m. every single day. Yeah, I mean, but waking up at 8 a.m., at 9 a.m., has been more realistic to me because before I'd wake up at 10 or 11 a.m. You know what I mean? Like, you can make changes, but just be more realistic. But I love you guys so much, and I'll see y'all in the next week. Eh! Besties, let me know what type of videos you want to see. You want to see what I eat in the days? You want to see vlogs? Let me know. Okay, I love you guys so much, and I'll see y'all next week. Bye-bye!